guys our wayfair mattress has arrived <laughs> the mattress in a box and uh we're very skeptical but it got great reviews and so we are going to unpack it unroll it and unwind so stay tuned first we got to get it up the stairs holy guacamole guys that's the bunk bed this is where it's going it comes with these handles on the side and it makes it a lot easier to bring it up the stairs. So thank you Wayfair for putting handles on the side of this thing. Okay, so there's actually two of them, but we'll do it one at a time. This one is gonna go on the bottom bunk right there. So let's unbox it and see what it's all about. All right, let's open this bad boy up. Mattress comes with no instructions, just what's written on the box, which is unpack, unroll, and unwind. So let's do it. This is really tightly packed, really, really tightly packed, so let's see if I can undo it. All right, I've undone the first layer, and you can hear the air rushing in. Wow. So now I got to take off this other layer so that I can actually put it on the bed. Let me see if I can set this up. Hopefully you guys can see it. It's uh, it is definitely filling with air. I only have precious seconds to get this out and on the bed before it becomes a full-fledged mattress. Oh, now that I've exposed it, exposed it, it is growing fast. It's almost anxiety, like, oh, I gotta race against time. Okay. So you can see it's already starting to fill up with air. It's very flimsy still, but I guess I just need to keep unwrapping it and give it time to settle. Let's get it on the bed. Oh, there you go. This one's gonna go on the bottom. Yeah. Okay, so so far it's like really uneven and frumpy. I'm hoping it evens itself out. Okay, so we've got it in. It's still not fully inflated, as you can see. Hoping uh, it inflates more. But... Uh, Yeah, so there's the first one. Let's do the second one. All right, we got the first mattress in. Now time to get the second mattress up top. Hopefully this one goes a little smoother and isn't as frumpy. I don't know what's going on with this first mattress. Hopefully just need some time to settle. So now we're gonna put the second mattress on. This one's going at the top. Wish me luck. This one, you could actually feel the material of it. It hasn't filled up with air yet. And it's like a... It's like, it's a pleasant feeling material. But yeah, none of it's filled up with air yet. Because we still haven't undone it. Interesante. Part two is coming undone. Okay. 
Oh no, it attacked my wife. So now we've got the second mattress up on top, <sighs> which kind of sucks because it's so high. It's it's so high it goes past the bars. That's dangerous. That's, <laughs> that's pretty bad. Oh god! This is not for a, bunk a bunk bed. bed. No, this is not for bunk beds. This is for like, you know, your This is for a regular bed. Adult. Yep. With a frame. I agree. Also really lumpy. <sighs> Maybe it hasn't fully uh yeah, I'm sure come out yet. This one's like unlumpy. Is it unlumping? Yeah, it's unlumping so far. Okay. But Now we gotta figure out what we're gonna do and how we're gonna block the oldest from jumping to her doom. Rolling. <laughs> Rolling to her doom. Right. Guys, so we went ahead and put in this piece, which was actually an extra piece that that came, came with Costway. They sent it on accident. <laughs> Thank God they did because it raises the bar just enough to where she has a little bit of warning before she comes off the end. Yikesy doodle dandy, right? <laughs> But let's uh, let's see how the bed feels. Uh, give it a. Uh, okay. It's pretty comfortable, actually. It's not bad. I'm gonna let the wife try it. Oh. It is comfortable. Right. It's just that you are stuck. <laughs> this is not for kids, I'm telling you. Look. No, this mattress is not for kids. Don't get this for the bunk bed, y'all. No, not. it's not for bunk beds. Let's... It is not for bunk beds. It's not for bunk beds. Like, it could be for kids if you just had one bed yeah, type but... thing. We'll let it, we'll give it some time to settle, get it set up, and uh, show you guys where we're at. Okay, there it is. The two uh, mattresses in the mail. Uh, they still have that soggy effect. <laughs> They've been installed for less than 30 minutes though, but still soggy. So we'll give it some time. It, some time. it feels sturdy. Feels sturdy. If you have this style of bunk bed, do not buy these. If you have any bunk bed, if you have any bunk bed these are not for you because uh they're very high up and they take away all the safety guards. Thank goodness we had this extra guard so that we could raise it just a little bit more for the person on top. This is where did we get this? We got this from Costway. This this bunk bed. Uh, these are the supports for the bunk bed. So far, so good. I am considering getting like thicker supports, um, but they seem to be holding out so far. I'm gonna always be keeping an eye on it. You know, we got this bed for uh, like six hundred dollars, and then we got the mattresses for like $900 more. So in total, this bed was $1,500. Wait, what? This bed was $1,500. That's a lot. Yeah, well, it's a twofer. <laughs> Lorelai, come check out your bed and tell us what you think. Hop in. Hop in. I didn't put anything yet. What do you girls think of your new bed? But it's too, it's too high. Yeah, cozy. Is it cozy? It's too high cozy. Yeah, I get it. This, this is, my, my side's the best. Because yeah. it's going to have rainbows. I love rainbows. Yeah. Because I have rainbow toothpaste. What do you think? Is it comfortable? Yes. I can go get some. Think. Mm, 
Look, 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 look. Oh, nice. But it is too high. And for Mia, it is too high. She's, she says it's too high, and she's right. It's way too high. Look at the clearance that she's got. Like, I, I really don't like that. Would you feel better if I rose this higher? I was thinking of, like, yeah, like, up to there. And drilling in this piece. Would you feel better? You would? I'll do that today. I'll do that today. Because I want you to feel comfortable. <laughs> you're never going to sleep good if you're always scared that you're just going to... Ah! I think there it stops her right there. It, it, it stops it's about her psychological her stability. Yeah, it's about her It's about her psychological comfort when she goes to bed, you know? Free. So here we are at the bottom of this bed, and it's got such a weird material. Yeah. Um, nice. It almost feels like paper mache. Yeah, but it's a puppet! Yeah. <laughs> So this it is the like springs. it is springs you can feel the packed in yeah. springs because we got the hybrid so that it wasn't just all memory foam the plan is to have my grandparents uh sleep in this bed when they visit but geez louise <laughs> they're not gonna have i have to down i have to down out of here i have to down yeah you are I'm so good to get out of here. <laughs> 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 Okay, so the bunk bed's all set up. What do you girls think of the mattress? It's too big and it's awesome. It's too cute and cozy. It is cute and cozy, but you're both right. You are both correct. <laughs> what do you think of the mattress, though? Is it comfortable? Yes. I can't wait to put my pillow on it. I can't wait to put my rainbow things. All right. And the, it's evening out finally. And then this is the Costway bunk bed. Addition. Addition. It comes with that third one, so that's good. And you can still use your iPads on them. Yep. And I'm even higher than before. Even I can scratch <laughs> my back. There you go.